Well, first of all, it said making apps, and I was like, what? I gotta take this class. And when I found out that it covers the math core, I was like, what? Double? I had to take it. <laughs> I felt like an app inventor. I was very restricted in a lot of things. And I was just curious to see what I could do with Java being implemented as well. I felt like I had to continue because I'm a design major. Um, everything needs to be visual. Like My planner is full of a bunch of highlighters, my notes as well. And when everything looked the same in text code, I was like, I don't know how to work this. Having App Inventor as like a visual so you actually see like, oh, this plugs into this and that goes there. And then it just makes everything much more like organized with basic knowledge of coding and how code works and thinking logically throughout code. Like it was just a good tool to have. It's like reading the instruction manual before you actually build something. Transferring from App Inventor to Java Bridge, it was like a friend. It was like, oh, text.label, uh, label.text thing. And you're like, oh, wait, it's there in Java Bridge. It's like, I can totally do this. I do still like coding. Like, the ability to create something just off of a computer is just amazing. When I go into web design, which is what I hope to do, <laughs> like, I always have it as a good foundation. Let's me know that I can do some coding, and that's reassuring. <laughs>